Hi there, and welcome back to uh, song six. So we are preparing for war. Because that's the only way we're going to get any resources. I remember there's something I haven't built. I need an army supply depot. Let's go build three of these. Second brewery. Oh, we're stacked out on green again. Turn the pottery off on that, more green. A good one to have, but yeah, we'll be flogging that soon. I hope you turn more into, into beer. That. No, I actually want to go in here. Hopefully, this will increase the amount of bread we're producing. No. Hmm, crime rate is spiked. Probably means we need more guard stations. Yeah, it's just a bit easy to avoid the law at the moment, isn't it? people getting the idea that it's a, a lawless place, do we? So it's not doing too bad. And we got across the river. Which I've never built a guard post in ever. Should have room there because I've got plenty of little nooks and crannies. I can't put one there. Little block on there. This works. This works. I can build them bigger. Ah. Don't want to surprise. All right. Hopefully. You fine gentlemen are doing your best. Citation's good. Tech is increasing. We've got our first library under construction. Fully upgraded lab. Is there anything key we're missing? Let's have a look at our crypts, shall we? There's a small need for crypts. So let's unlock crypts. And universities while I'm here. Oh, Master of Farms is dead. Let's do what we always do and we go down to the farms. Find some work random schmoes working. Hello there. You are now the Master of Farms, a very important job. I'd like to be allowed more jewelry. Well, yes. City funds are key and stretch, keeping the just going. Although we got a nice level of fabric. Let's find a glove here. I'm best off going over here, aren't I? And there's one over here. There we go, Taylor. Over here. 
There you go. Let's give you some other people on work in here. How are weavers doing? The headmaster is dead. We'll grab somebody out of the labs. Congratulations, Alora, you're now first headmaster and first human. One homeless human. Uh, that's unusual. I don't really have a nobles district. How is homelessness doing? Any big spikes? No, it looks like we've got it under control. There's a mine problem up here, All right? There you go. Let's have a check down here. This is probably where it's coming from. There you go. We're having a happiness drop. What services do we low on? Drinking services. And another eatery could be useful. Could just do a small eatery. Civics, health. It's entertainment, isn't it? Yeah. Drink that down by a bit. Extend it down towards the road one. That's probably a good size eatery, because it just needs storage. some doors. Oh, we desperately need people. We're actually max out on people for now for once. Oh, good loads of people have died in the cold. I wasn't one that was gonna be a card cold snap. I wonder why that was so bad this year. Uh, that's where the population went, this brewery's up and running. Make it more efficient. Hopefully when it gets warm, we'll see uh, this improve. Loyalty's increasing. Burial is dropping because uh, there's not enough graves. Alright, where should I put our crypt? This looks like a good place, a little bit out of the way. Graves can line the walls. Right, let's see how many stat how big are the statues. Oh they need a, a lot to get some respect up. Can we crowd a couple more graves in here? 
I think we can. That's going to be expensive. Might just need another normal graveyard. I've got one down here yet, have we? If I leave a little bit at the end, this should cover us for a good long time and be central for the, the new city. So that's 112 graves. By the time I've whacked in trees to try and get the respect up, can run down here 39% respect so that's going to eat up a huge chunk of stone wood but I'm going to have to get more people doing wood because that's going to actually hurt us in some ways down to three to fill those gaps in. The flowers can run across here. You must not be blocked by those items. Okay. So they're going to be passed as well then. 5% isn't too bad. Okay. We're back up to 64 positive. That's probably because loads of people just kicked out of their um, jobs. Um, it wasn't that one. We've got fell tree jobs. We just haven't got anyone to do it. That's just what happened. The population dipped. And it gave that a problem. Alright. Quality 77, 100% for fulfillment. They want schools and stuff like that. We're going to be educating because we don't feel the need to indoctrinate. Work time's not too bad. Corpses is going up. This is not too many. We would like more roads or better roads. We have got two and a half K. So maybe now is the time to uh, finally step up to prepare. Speed 20. Dire. The stone road is Access 80. That's 100 plus extra speed. I don't even know where the centre of this city is. It's not built like that. That's going to eat a good amount. Let's the button just focus on the phone room. Did we start up here? Why oh, we need to move the throne? Start increasing the throughput on these like um more travelled roads, shall we? a lot of stone quick and 
this is obviously a main trunk road. As is this here. Alright, that will do for now. That's probably going to eat most of our stone and workers. Oh, we've got a metal. How much metal? We can solve that. There we go. Training ground's been upgraded. Probably should have saved those for that. With that brewery. I quite got enough to that. Not a problem I was expecting actually. Too much metal. Hopefully that will just keep good and long. Wood is definitely our shortage at the moment. Let's find an iron ore mine. All mine. Yeah, coal mine would be fine to upgrade. out for now. That's fine. Why have we got 77 deranged people? Wow. Alright, we need a big um, asylum. Health. Asylum. Oh, this little spot up here is just asking to be asylumated. This may well be too big. It literally just sells. Alright. That's simple enough to fix. I'll miss one there. And then we'll come in and take this wall out. And then we'll put in another row of shell cells. Actually, we'll just call that at that size, actually, because that's 750 metal. And I'm going to nope out at that point. Maybe it needs to be one bigger. So I can come along and put bits in the centre to make it cheaper. So as well I've got 500 stone, I should notice that before. sent a load of people mad. Alright, we need to winter.
Yes, if everyone could start getting hold of my trees, it'd be amazing. You know, a tavern would make people happier. The brewery means we've actually got a surplus of drinks for once. So you're a drink supply, you're at that supply, you're a ration, and we actually need two more of you guys. Soldiers. We need more battle armor stuff like that being made. That's the closest janitor to here. We might need a janitor. Slot one in here. I like to put my janitors in out of the way places. How many of stone ruins looking? Much better. People are zipping up and down on them. weird things the ways the city's built I don't have a main strip I like this though because I do think when people plan their cities you do end up with this kind of like grid system the American stuff and that's not how this type of city would have been built this type of city is built on here they don't have a boot like on the fly it's built as people just grow and the government comes along and goes, hmm, this is a bit of a problem, we need to do something about this. And spots places where they should have put roads in ages ago. And with main roads like this that apparently don't have anything going through them. We're at max to metal again. But I shouldn't really be complaining, but yeah, this is a good problem to have. Um Can you store metal in here please? Gone blind. Down here. Probably needs like a research. At all. Crafting. Makeshift armor. Player bonus for 400. Mechanic specialization. Smith specialization. Jewelry is something we just don't have at all. Five percent boost work with safety. There we go. There's people can't say I don't think about them. Defense smelter. That'll do for now. What's my um, library coming on? Which I'm expecting to take forever. So what I should probably do is find my import zone. Say stop importing metal. 
I've got gems for a bit. Gemstone and clay. I wish they'd also import coal. Going a bit of a coal shortage. And clothing. There we go. That gives you a few more things to spend your money on. 89 paper. Short. As cold is murdering us every winter now. I need more hearths. Pop it off the road. I'd love to know where the... Oh, Master of the Forge is dead. Another random peasant. To the Master of the Forge. They sold dread noise shape. Yeah, there's nothing telling me where, where my people are freezing to death. And they're in the hundreds as well, so it's not like it's a whole number of people. There's a half there. Half there. Don't think I need one down here. I feel like there's good access to heart. There's only 10 people without a home. So why are hundreds freezing to death every winter? There's good heart access all over the place. I've got a ma massive amount of cut stone. Let's find a densely populated area. There's a lack of wood that's doing this. Got houses everywhere, but they don't seem to be the type of people want to move into. Okay, well, that will be cover. Oh, how are we minus 300? 327 people died in the cold. What the hell? It's a lack of wood, isn't it? They haven't got their stuff to heat their house. Access. Drink is good. Surfaces. Labs is good. Meals, baths, drinking tables is terrible, I know about that. Eating spots is 62%. That shouldn't be losing, losing these thousands of people. How is this graveyard going? No, it fell some trees near here. Hunt for the leather, but I don't really need more leather. It's taken off a good amount of the map now, haven't we? How is my world conquest thing going? So we'd be striking into Sylvan because they are the least powerful of the two, aren't they? Sylvan has one army and 2.4k soldiers. We'd match them easily. Our population is 
nosedived. So I forgot what's killing us at winter. Increase metal storage. I think we can actually. I think I've got the population to do it. Hmm, this might be the death of this city. How's it going up in storage land? 300. Shortage of clothing. Canteen seems to be doing quite well. Canteen seems to be doing pretty well. I'm having trouble to feed everyone. That's that's good. Another rest out might be useful, but again, I've got to wait for my population to recover. Tavern's taking a while. I've got too much on construction at the moment. Where are my furniture makers? The shortage of wood is killing me. Input depot. We're good for stone. Start importing wood. Gems. We've got 70 gems, that should be good. Starting building furniture. You don't need to have another metal one. Minus 300 people is not fun. Hopefully the number of guards will help bring the crime rate down. Sanitation is dropping as well. Not sure I can do about that. The, la like the labs and stuff like that empty out first. up the pop on a load of these places but I just can't. Maxed out on veg as well. Yet another warehouse. Too much to be built and not enough space. Got 17 days of food preferences though. So. We're about to come back into winter. We need this graveyard online. Is there any way I can prioritise it? Freeze is coming. No, 
nice to actually have a surplus of drink though. Minus 609. It's not good. We made it to 50 years. That's good. And a population of 4.4. .4. But we've hit a wall hard. Only two people working in there. Do I just go for the assault? We'll see how we are towards the end of the episode. We've got another 20 minutes. We'll get through this winter. If it seems to be in a nosedive, we'll attack. We never got our opiates production off the line, did it go around, did we? It's only doing three. Bakery's only it's playing forty-three. Because having the food days is one of the few things that's gonna drag our population back up. Right, we're entering winter. The number of cold is increasing. I've ordered more halves to be built. Furniture shortage as always. Oh, we lost another booth. Yeah, man. We can recover. You have to take half the population off the wall. All right. Cold is holding. We can get through winter. Without mass death, we should be on there, okay. Do you want to have up to 100 Dandarians coming? There we go, we've got a token Dandarian for now. You probably hate it here. to a hundred for these. Death and destruction. We don't have it too coming. So yeah. I'll take any workers at the moment. Enough emissaries, don't care. Wrongful deaths is starting to spike, but it's nowhere near last year. Okay. Population has dipped so 400 jobs short. Master of Feast has passed. Yep. Yeah. Oh, there we go. 104 deaths to the cold. Yeah, we're in some sort of weird cold cycle. I don't know what's causing it. I've got enough hearts. It's the lack of wood, isn't it? All right, we need to attack. Oakenstead here has got garrison of a thousand. Someone's only got a garrison of four hundred.
Not supplying the depots yet, yeah, I need more clothing. Desperately. Oh yeah, this is a cycle. Well, this is pretty much this, isn't it? Because... We'll recover to the point where... We should have a load of roots. Anything that's eating a lot of people. Do we need this bakery? Turn off the bakery. Turn off this bakery. Turn off the training ground. The lab's already empty. Turn off the masonry. Massive reduced number of people making paper as the labs are empty. Need the weavers working. Import section. I always forget where I put this. Okay, so we're not getting our bonuses from technology anymore. That's the export depot. here. I was looking for the wrong colour. Alright. Stop putting clay. Stop putting furniture for now. Focus on clothing and um, wood. You're not expecting, you export cotton. And what else have I got huge amounts of? Might be time to start exporting veg, but only worth like 35,000. And you can start putting fruit again above a huge amount. Right, population is at minus 400. Let's turn this training ground. That's going to help. I need the troops trained. What point is this is going to war? Already turned off two bakeries. I can't turn any more off. Masonry can go off. The weavers are doing okay, actually. Shut down the smaller weavers. Just leave one weaver. Hopefully let's get more tailors in. Yeah, I know, I know. Change recipes using cloth. Oh, we can't because we've lost all our tech bonuses. Right, minus 200. Hey, the 
labs are coming back online. That's good. Shut down two more bakeries. Three more bakeries, probably. Not that one, however, because that's this level three one. There we go, we've got 6,000. Ration maker we don't need for now. Shut down. And the brewery also, use, we don't need two breweries, we'll shut this one down. But you know, this one activate, shut this one down. So this is the fully upgraded one. Much more efficient use of time. Dummy tailors. Let's shut down two potters. Only got one weaver, one potter. Twenty three. I just looking for one more big ticky item. Don't shut down any more bakers. Having stuff like that are useful. Bakers. What are we doing for carpenters? See. Might as well shut down some of these small carpenters that haven't been upgraded. And then upgrade. Right, that gets us back up to positive. As long as no one freezes to death next year, we should be okay. The temple, these temples are employing a lot of people, but I need them to keep them happy. You've got to be more than they're dead. Alright, operations down to 3.6. got eight spare people, we've got a little bit of wood. Which hopefully means we won't freeze to death next winter. If we just get through one winter without freezing to death, we can get through this. Yes, I know there's 157 dead people. In there in the graveyard, though. No. We're getting topped, topped up on the amount of wood we need. This training ground. Gone. And then we'll deconstruct it. That'll give us more wood. Which can then be carried off. Alright, but 28 people spare. 18 days of food then. Rockin has decided. Never one of my neighbours, is it? Look at these people here. Snaking all the way down that coast. I'd like to be able to make this map bigger. I have two factions on here. We're here, we need to attack this one here. They're the smallest rivals. That then gets us access up to the north. But, of course, that needs stuff like clothing. We've got food and supplies. 
I actually have got supplies of clothing now. I've got drink. Clothing. Rations. Go to the world map. The army. Could send out several divisions. Now these divisions down here. I need much larger storage areas. No, not crops. Right. There we go, military supply. Alright, we'll go for one more winter, we'll see what happens. Got 400 wood in the stores now. Got 71 people in spare, we've got huge amounts of cotton. Export cotton. Let's give all the export depots extra people to help them load up. Maybe you've got four, so let's give everyone. Trade you one five, yeah, tourism brought in to seven hundred. Oh a simple place for by a simple death death spot. Okay. All my labs should be up and running. Things are just not going well out there. Should just be clothing. Yeah, that's fine. Two hundred spare people. It's about right for the amount of iron ore we got. Let's shut you down. Move everyone into this one. <laughs> bow is working. I did bows. You're making battle armor now. of cold is there but it's not spiking too much. Normally the end of winter we see the mastiffs. <laughs> Come on, get through winter without a mastiff. And what's this graveyard sunlight down here? That'll solve so many of our problems. Just need someone to deliver, deliver some stone to it. That goes the caravan off, selling grain. Wrongful deaths, just two. So yeah, it was the lack of wood. 
We're now sitting nicely at 2k. We now have a, a not enough clothing. Find one of the ones in the middle of town. Right, you. Right, that gives us plenty of clothing storage. Okay, that will be immediately stolen by the people, I'm sure. And if not the people, like this. Let's get up another bakery pack online, shall we? Change your recipe. It's fine. Bakers are up here, aren't they? Fully employ you. We're touched to coal. And then I make sure we import coal. That'll take the pressure off wood a little bit. Not much I can do with my coal mines. No, because I need materials. Just do your upgrade. There we go, they've now got more spaces for people. Alright. Things are improving. So no janitor in this area. Crumble crumble in. I'll have a janitor if anyone ever gets around to building it. I think the machinist is desperately needed. And the library should be okay. Grain up, we've got tons of grain. Bring this group back online. Bring this bakery back online. Make them use coal. Alright, back up to 4k. People have forgotten the freezing. Labs are doing their work slowly. Right, let's bring another pottery online. Got plenty of clay. Can I actually make people happier? So you can have access to pots now and clay. See how long that lasts. That might be the happiness boost I need to get this population roaring again. Hey look, we've actually got some cash in reserve. Most of these carpenters are offline, but that's fine. You want to be using the upgraded ones anyway. Alright, make me furniture. Oh, 
I've got enough to create a little lavatory. That'll make people happier. There we go. After you should find so we should bring the masons back online while I think about it. There we go. The great dip is over. We have stocks of most things. And hopefully some buildings will be finishing soon. So you collect up some drinks. You collect up some supplies. You're going to be collecting armor. But this is good. All good. Oh, the ration maker. I need the ration maker back online. There we go. So, as always, thanks for watching, I'll see you all next time.